What is up guys, and welcome back to another video. Uh, today we're going to be taking a look at version 1.7.1. Uh, let's do it. Before we go any further, please click the subscribe button, turn it from red to grey. I'm trying to hit 200 subscribers as soon as I can, so any support you can give my channel would be massively appreciated. Uh, that's just about it, really. I'll leave more stuff about my second channel in the description. Uh, so today we're going to be going through the 1.7.1 update and just looking at some new things, so let's just get into it. So the first thing of interest is obviously a new depot at Willowfield, so I'm just going to hop into the class 377 for now, on a route out of Willowfield, let's see, Willowfield to Port Benson, that'll do. What have we got? So we've got a Willowfield station depot and a Willowfield mainline depot, so let's check this one out first. I'm quite interested to see what it looks like, because I saw the sneak peek a while ago. Um... But either way, this is going to be interesting. Oh, wow, look at this. <whistles> this is nice. 0.17 miles, okay. Obviously, my computer can't cope with Roblox, so we're going to have to make do with this as the best quality we're going to get. But anyway, this is nice. It's really modern. It's kind of like an open Thamia green thing for Electrostars. There's more static objects, which is nice. I'm presuming then they've redone the track a little bit. That's probably what's happened. Or well, they've moved the shops back. Oh no, maybe they haven't. It's just here. Oh my god. Okay. Wow. Not expecting that at all, but now there's some kind of use of Platform 3 at Willowfield. So the station itself hasn't changed at all. They've just, you know, moved Uber Yeats and Akaya, obviously supposed to be Ikea, uh, back a little bit. So, that's the only thing they've actually done to that. So here we are then, obviously, at the other end of the platform. Blimey, that was a snug fit. That was perfect slot from me there. But yeah, you can see, this shop's new. I think Stars, Gates and Portals. I don't recall seeing that there before. But yeah, obviously they haven't changed it much, because these shops used to be right up against this wall here. Um, so they have changed it slightly, because they've put a couple of sidings in. And then obviously the main part of the depot's over here and they've got, you know, lines onto the main line. So we're just going to quickly drive past it once again and just see where the other part comes out. Close the doors. I'm going to try not to make this too long, but you know me, it'll probably go on for like 20 minutes. Anyway, Beachley. I'm probably not even going to drive to Beachley. I'm literally just going to go past the depot. Also, this is the first time I've played SCR in weeks. So... Excuse me, it's not that I'm out of practice, you could tell that six over 6,000 experience, I know what I'm doing. Anyway, it's a really nice depot, it's big and there's loads of sidings and the static objects are really cool. But again, I'm not really sure if they would ever fill it, <laughs> for obvious reasons. That would be a bit problematic if you were signalling that depot when it was full. Ouch, that would be horrible. Oh, hold on a minute. Have they changed the scenery? Or is this just a bridge that goes out? Tell you what, no, I'm going to drive a bit further. I think I'm going to drive to Beachley. But either way, that looks like the depot. Does it continue on? Let's see if there's anything different. So the different thing is, is they've added some bushes just on either side. These hills are exactly the same. This wall was here previously in these trees. So to be honest, that's kind of a bit disappointing because this has been sneak previewed for a while now and the fact that they didn't actually upgrade the appalling scenery on this branch line overall is not great, I will be honest. So yeah, that lo it doesn't look like they've done any more to it so we're going to kill that but either way, this branch line is just so undetailed and to be honest I'm very surprised they didn't upgrade the scenery if they were changing the depot at Willowfield. So, anyway, with that said, let's just drive out of the other depot. Here we go, just reset my character. Is that the right one? Did I do the station depot before? No, this is the right one, isn't it? I think. Yeah, yeah, it's facing the other way. Okay, ooh, right next to some Electro Stars right here. Anyway, off we go. 30 mile per hour through the depot, obviously. The depot signals are showing up to a white aspect. We were clear to go. It's just like the ground outside my house. It's snowing so much. Apparently it's forecast to snow until 6 o'clock tonight. 
on the on the day of recording. Depends on whenever you're watching this. Anyway, right, speaking of snow, I think I'd better wish all my viewers. I hope you all had a very very merry Christmas, and I hope 2021 is better for you than 2020 was. I'm sure that will be the case for most people. But anyway, with that said. Yeah, there's not much different driving out of the other depot because you've just passed the static 357 out of there. And then we're going to go past here onto the main line. But that's a really good depot. I like that a lot. I'm probably going to give it a 7.5 out of 10 because it's detailed. I just think they could do with maybe putting a shed in there rather than just leaving it all blank. But open but open space, there's plenty of room. And is, I don't know if it's especially for Electro Stars. I'll check that out now. So looking at this, let me just try a civity. Just go in the three three one just for the time being. Can I spawn? Yes. So no, it doesn't look like it's just for electro stars. It just looks like though there were electro stars as the only static objects in the depot, if you like. But no, according to this it looks like you can use all trains on Connect at that depot, which is a good sign. But speaking of revamped depots No, I'm on the wrong operator. Ouch, that's a bit embarrassing. Uh, apparently Airport Parkway Depot has had an update, so we're going to check that out now. We'll go into the 802, one of the more recent trains I've managed to splash the cash on. Anyway, here we go. So let's go in the depot and let's see what it looks like. I'll check out the siding after in case they have changed that. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, oh my god. Okay. Well, I like that. First impressions, that's very good. Because that, that's like, that looks to me, you can see that orange logo over there by where my mouse is. Uh, that looks like this is some sort of Airlink head offices or something maybe. And this is obviously a shed, and this is the power station, and that's the connect line over there. So, either way, this looks brilliant. Just like the train though. Oh, this train is absolutely beautiful by the way. Um, but yeah, lots of sidings, but it looks like they all just conjoin over there. And then, obviously, it just goes straight out onto the main line. Oh, that's a bit of a tight squeeze past the building. But anyway, over the express lines, and it just continues round to Leighton. So, oh dear. I'm go Like I said, I'm going to try not to make this too long a video. So, that's Airport Parkway Depot. Let's check out Airport Parkway Siding now to see if that's changed at all. Okay, just spawning at Airport Parkway Depot. Uh, let's see if this has changed. I spawned at the depot. Oh, come on, trains. You numpty. Right. <laughs> Apologies for that blip. I'm a bit out of practice. Okay, so I need to remember to spawn at Airport Parkway siding. And so we're heading towards the airport, not away from it. Okay. I don't suppose this has particularly changed a lot or at all. No, it hasn't, because that Toby's Blenders thing was there before. Uh, and you can see now these two lines go in that way, the connect lines, and that thing just about out of view that's loaded out is the, where the connect lines go under, and then they kind of go round and out that way towards Leighton and Hampton Hargate. Uh, but apart from... Oh dear, sorry about that. Uh, but apart from that, Airport Parkway, de Airport Parkway siding rather hasn't changed. But I like the depot a lot. I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10 again. But that's not the only depot to receive an upgrade. Okay, the new depot is... Whitney Green. <laughs> wow, okay. Wow, Zaruni, I was not expecting that at all. So, there's clearly some static 165s over there. There's some more houses. Yes, more detail to waterline. And you can see, this This is a nice depot as well. So the, la the tracks come over there in the Morganstown shuttle. They come down here from Benton and Newry and they go round, so... Let's have a quick drive, because I think this could be quite interesting, potentially. So you see you've got houses here, you've got, you know, static railways there, some sort of workhouse shed, or, I do apologise, my computer's lagging out rather a lot. Anyway, we'll come around here. That's a nice depot! That's probably, to be honest, I think that's my favourite one of the lot. Uh, I'm, I give that an 8 out of 10, I think that's brilliant. I really like that a lot. Uh, so, clearly it doesn't look like Whitney Green Station itself has changed. Obviously I made a video about discussing what's after 1.7. I don't know if I can link that in the top right hand corner, but if I can, it will be there now. 
So go check that out. I'm going to overshoot here, aren't I? Not quite. Okay. Um, but yeah, and that and that video featured tram link as well as some other things. And I'd want to say a massive thank you for the support on that video as well. Uh, just this morning, I think it hit over one thousand views, and I only uploaded it about two weeks ago. So it's done really well. Anyway, like I say, please don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. Turn that red button grey. And if you want, turn the bell icon on, because then you get notified immediately when I upload new content. Which, let's be honest, is not very often, because my upload schedule has kind of gone through the window the last sort of six months over lockdown and everything. But then again, I am at that stage in my life where I do have some rather important exams. So I'm afraid videoing is kind of having to take a back seat. Anyway, here we are. We're now approaching Greenslade. So... Apparently Greenslade has been changed. You can see the tramlink lines are going a different way. This looks promising. There's more scene there's scenery. Okay. Ooh. What's this? <gasps> it's an island platform. Ooh, hold on. Oh, this is lovely. Look at this. Wow, I'm gonna have to come back and have a look on foot. Ah! Okay, cool. Right. Okay, and what is important is the Tramlink station is still here and it's got its own branding. So, Tramlink, there is no question, must be coming back to SCR because why would they keep the station there if they were going to get rid of it? Okay, so I have discovered a bug with this new update, and it is, you can spawn at connect stations. What is going on there? Where did my mouse go? Okay, so you can spawn at connect stations, express stations, but you cannot spawn at waterline or air link. So that is a problem, which probably should be made aware. I don't suppose the developers will be watching my crappy YouTube channel, but if you happen to be, please fix this, because so I can go and have a look at Greenslade, because it looked really nice, and to be honest, I don't really want to have to go back and drive there again. Anyway, to be honest, that just about concludes today's video. Uh, there's not much else I need to say. I think I've covered everything. If I haven't, you can let me know in the comments what it is. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hashtag train sim and Roblox to 200 by Easter. That would be brilliant. Um, what else do I need to say? There's stuff about my second channel in the description, my Instagram account, you can join my Discord. That's all for my second channel though. They'll all be down in the description. Hope you had a Merry Christmas, stay safe guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.